Hello, everybody on the Master Shah Dao Center, Healing Center, Toronto Facebook page. And welcome, welcome, welcome. We are so excited to be here with you. And if you're joining us live, we encourage you to share in the comments. Who are you? Where are you from? And more. So welcome, welcome, welcome. And we have a very exciting conversation in store for us today. And we are joined by a very, very special guest guest and she is a certified life coach and best-selling author as well as a Tao practitioner and her name is Susan Housen so welcome Susan hello everyone it's so wonderful to be here thank you Alexia for asking me to to share with everybody and to be here it's exciting Thank you. And we're so excited to have you here because we know you have lots of, you know, wonderful stories and, and powerful insights and wisdom and more to share with us. And so we are very excited at the Master Shah Dao Healing Center because this weekend we have um, a a Dao Hands workshop. And so these are always very exciting leading up to having new Dao Hands practitioners on Mother Yay. Earth. Yay! So <laughs> we would love to hear from you, um, your journey with Dao Hands and mm. you know, how, how have they impacted your life? Thank you, Alexia. It, it was an interesting journey. I've, I have done a lot of different modalities throughout the years. I'm a Reiki master. If you've any of you have watched the movie The Secret, I've pretty much done all the training that has been in The Secret and, and know many of those people and they're beautiful and wonderful people. And somehow I was on an email list and one day I received this email about this thing called Dow Hands. And I immediately heard, you have to do this. And I had no idea what it was at that time. And I'm so glad that I listened to my heart because what it did was it led me to, to training to, to have my Tao hands, which for me is like taking everything that I have had and all the training that I've done and putting it in a package and raising the frequency and vibration through the roof. And so, it has impacted pretty much every aspect of my life. Uh, as you said, I am a, a certified life coach and, and I train life coaches as well. So I, I turn on my Dow hands before every client that I have, before any program that I teach, before anything actually. And what I have found is that the the connection to the participants that are taking the program, the connection with my clients is at a deeper level and we connect heart to heart, soul to soul, which really supports both the learning and the, uh, the coaches and the, the clients that come through. It's very powerful. Wow, thank you so much for sharing this, Susan. And thank you everyone who's watching. We welcome you to share in the comments. I see Carol said hi from Saskatchewan and we oh. welcome all of you. And it's amazing to hear, Susan, how you have integrated this so seamlessly just into your life and into your practice and, and really into the way that you serve other people and you train other people in a very practical way. Mm -hmm. And so that is really, really interesting. Um, and especially with your history of having studied so many other modalities and belief systems and different ways of up leveling our frequency and vibration and, and life. So it's really amazing to hear this about Dao hands. And um, you have been you know, connected to these practices and, and you are a practitioner on many levels. And um, kind of curious because we also have, um, we have a lot of exciting things happening right now. And another thing that we have coming up, which is a workshop is um, called Moving with Grace and Light into 2021 with Francisco. Yes. <laughs> so this is gonna be a really exciting workshop because, and maybe you can speak a little bit to the importance of using the field, the Tao calligraphy healing field and using these practices, you know, to move into a new year. 
Like, mm. why is that even important? Mm. Um, and how has that kind of impacted your life or yeah. anything you'd like to share to that? Absolutely. Uh, it It's such a great question, Alexia, because one of the things that I find with Dow Hands is that it has gone seamlessly for me into everything that I do. So I use it on a daily basis. Um, if, for example, yesterday, one of our, our kids who lives out west, her her partner had to go to the hospital and she contacted me and asked me if I could do a, a Dow Hands healing blessing for him because they were really worried and, and felt anxious. And with everything that's going on in the world, we wanna bring more love, peace and harmony within ourselves. We want to be able to navigate on a daily basis with those beautiful words of grace and light. And having your Tao hands really supports that. You can support yourself because I, I also teach at a university and a lot of my students are feeling stressed. And so before our classes, I use my Tao hands to, to support the class and to support all the students that are in the class. Um, even with, you know, there was a bird that hit our, our window one day and went down and didn't, wasn't moving. And so we brought it in and wrapped it in a towel and we uh, did our Dow hands and about half an hour later it flew away. So it, it helps in, in all those regards. Moving into to 2021, for me, it's a new year. For me, it's a year that we want to begin with ease, grace, light, so that we don't know what's going to continue to happen in our world. We want our world to be a better place for ourselves and our family and humanity. And being able to increase, as you said, the field, what Dow hands and many other things that, that the Toronto Center teaches is to, to increase the frequency and the vibration and the light field for ourselves, for our family, our community, our world and humanity. And I know that Francisco and the other teachers are masters at teaching these things and providing uh, very practical tools and skills for us to be able to navigate through life with, as you said, grace and light. And for me, when we're able to do that, we're, no matter what happens around us, we're able to get through it much more effectively. Mm -hmm. And it's, there's simple practical techniques that anybody can do, everybody can learn, and are really an, important for us to share with others. Beautiful. Thank you so much, Susan, mm -hmm. for sharing this. And yeah, it really is so true what you're sharing about these practices and these tools and the abilities that they really provide to us and also the transformation. So much of what we've experienced this year, um, we are empowered to transform and uplift with these transmissions, with these practices and anybody can do it and especially with the guidance of someone like francisco it is really 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 extraordinary the kind of transformation that can take place even in a three-hour workshop so one thing that i know for me personally that transformed a lot in these practices was my concept of time and value and what comes out of that because what would come out of a three hour workshop with Francisco could have been some mindset that transformed or some pain in my body or something that I've been carrying my whole life. So and what often we're not even aware word? of it. And right. we're often not even aware of it. It's like, what? That's been there <laughs> this whole time. Oh my gosh. And now I see it and now it's gone. And it's right. just like a whole new world. Yeah. So that's really, really powerful. It is powerful. And, and the other thing is for me, at being a, a, a teacher and an instructor, 
the power of the teachings that Francisco give are extraordinary. And I say that as somebody who has taught for a very long time and has gone through a lot of different kinds of trainings, that the way that he is able to connect to every single person that is taking the program, his heart and soul, you feel it so deeply. And his ability to support you in, as we were saying, releasing things and transforming things that we didn't even sometimes know that were there is absolutely incredible. He is uh, an incredible person. He's an incredible teacher. And he is able to support each and every person that takes a, is in the program with that transformation process as well. And it takes a very special person, a very special soul to be able to do that. Absolutely. Absolutely. And Francisco will also be leading a workshop in the new year. Now, this actually hasn't even been released yet, everybody. This is exclusive information. We don't even have the links yet, but they're coming. You'll see the event on our Facebook and in the description of this video. So, um, but they are coming, but this is a very coveted workshop of ours. It happens only once a year and it's really exciting and it's all about our ancestors. And so we are kind of moving with that theme of grace and, and light and courage and cultivating courage and compassion um, by, mm -hmm. you know, accessing and connecting to messages from our ancestors, honoring our ancestors. And one of the very, very special things that um, this workshop offers is actually discovering who one of our most important ancestors is. And this has been something for me personally for the last three years that has guided my entire year. Because that one soul, that person who they connect you to guides you throughout the entire year. And there's been so many instances where um, opportunities happen or um, the path of that year, the focus of that year, the actions, the things that I'm doing are aligned with that ancestor. And so it really is a great blessing to have that awareness and that information um, to start the year. Mm -hmm. And um, so Susan, we have taken this workshop together before. Yes. So how has it been for you um, experiencing that workshop, finding that information and anything you feel called to share? It's, it's probably one of most everybody's favorite workshops because it, people say, what? I, I have this person as one of my most important ancestors. Wow. How incredible is that and as you said one of the things that's so great is that there's a there they show up because we have many 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 different ancestors as we know however they show up with a message for us they're showing up at this time and they want us to know something that's going to support us as you said moving forward with you know that that grace and light as we talked about before and so sometimes those ancestors are ancestors that are people that are familiar to people. Sometimes they're not familiar to us. I know m one of mine from mine from last year was a, uh, a theorist. And because I teach at a university and I have developed some programs, what it really spoke to me was around aligning a new theory of how to engage with children, youth, and families that embraces something that no other theory has embraced. And it's, it's the, the theories and the, the information that we learn through the, the center and the programs that are offered there. So like yourself, it has really supported me and led me to think outside the box and to look at what are all the opportunities that lay before me that I can learn from them and be guided 
by them to move forward in a more powerful and productive way. Yeah. Wonderful. Absolutely. Absolutely. And as we kind of close our conversation today, Susan, do you have any final words that you'd like to share with our viewers? Absolutely. So Dow Hands, if you haven't registered yet, register. If your heart is saying do it and you're not sure the reason, do it. That's what I did and I have not looked back. You won't either. It will support you in everything that you do. If you want to move into 2021, feeling that sense of grace and ease and light, sign up for the program that Alexia was telling you about that Francisco will be doing. And if you're really curious about the ancestors, it's a fun workshop. It's an exciting workshop. Sign up for that as well. Awesome. I love it. And we'll be seeing you all there. So <laughs> we look forward to it. We look forward to it. And thank you everyone who's joined us. There's lots of you joining live. Thank you everyone. And thank you to all of you who are watching this on the recording on our Facebook, on our Instagram and much more. And as always reach out to us if you have any questions and we look forward to connecting with you soon. Bye everyone. Bye. <laughs>